Hi, this is Susan Broder from Speak Languages and Travel the World with another series of phrasal verbs with the get. Uh, but before I do so, I'd like you to subscribe to my YouTube channel so I'm sure that you're enjoying these videos, that they're useful for you and I can make some more. Now, before I start, I do hope that it's not too noisy. I've forgotten my microphone, but it was important for me to do this video now. Uh, unfortunately, it's the rush hour, so there's a lot of traffic. Okay, so, uh, this morning I got ready uh, and I got dressed for a wedding. Uh, some friends of mine uh, were getting married this morning and I got ready for it. How long does it take you to get ready? How long does it take you to prepare for uh, work, for school? And what about going to a special event? Does it take you longer to get ready for a special event? So um, it took me about an hour to get ready. And let me think, yes, I got dressed with a pretty dress and I got dressed with um, something to make me a bit uh, shiny. And then I went down to the registry office uh, because uh, you can get married in a church or you can get married in a registry office. Uh, uh, the registry office is in the town hall, so my friends got married there. And after the wedding we went to the reception on a beautiful hill. Here you can see the beautiful hill in the Bavarian countryside. It was uh, really, really amazing. And now the sun's going down because uh, it's evening, but I thought it was worth documenting, so I, that's why I came here to show you how beautiful it is. Now, they uh, gave us a lot of delicious food, quite a lot uh, to drink. We all got a little tipsy. Get tipsy means that when you drink a little bit too much, um, you feel comfortable, you wouldn't really drive a car, but you can um, actually, yes, uh, enjoy yourself still. Instead, some people who didn't do it today get drunk, and that's no good. Getting drunk is absolutely losing control. So I hope you never get drunk, uh, but you might get a little tipsy occasionally. Okay, and then I met a lot of people I've never met before and we got along amazingly. Uh, get along with someone means to be good friends with someone. So we got along very well and uh, it was very nice. It was a very pleasant afternoon. So let's uh, summarize that. So get ready is to prepare and uh, so you can get ready for work, get ready for school, or get ready, get dressed for a special occasion. Then uh, I got dressed, and get dressed means to put some clothes on. Um, do you get dressed in a uniform when you go to work or go to school? And uh, does it take you long to get dressed? Uh, then there was uh, to get married and as I said get married is when two people uh, join together and form a family for the rest of their lives usually either in church or at the registry office so it's an official family and not just a couple living together then there's the verb to get tipsy which means to drink a little bit too much or to um, get drunk which is definitely drink too much and get out of control finally if you get along with someone it means you're really really good friends and uh, uh, that's something pleasant you can also get along with your brother your sister and relatives Whilst we're on the subject of marriage and weddings, I wanted to explain the difference. So, uh, marriage is a period of your life that you spend together with somebody else. Uh, so, it's not a ceremony. The wedding is the ceremony and the marriage is the actual life together with another person. The wedding is the ceremony on that day. So you celebrate uh, a wedding on a day with your friends and the wedding couple, but then they spend the rest of their life and you, together, so you wish them a uh, happy and long marriage, whilst the wedding would only be wishing them a beautiful wedding day. So don't forget, marriage is a, a period in your life and wedding is a day in your life. Have a look at this landscape. I really love Bavaria. It's so beautiful. It's one of my favorite landscapes. Okay, and I hope you enjoyed this video. 
and I hope you subscribe to my YouTube channel so I know that you're interested and we can make some more videos like this. Meanwhile, enjoy the beautiful countryside here and uh, hope to see you in the next video. Bye! Bye for now!